going on. What am I supposed to do? They blurred us at home every day knowing I'm at work with the woman who literally was my first choice to spend the rest of my life with. So I just got off the phone with Detective Donovan. I don't say yes, it. He seemed a little steamed. Yeah, I know, I was out of line. You took your brother into a crime scene. Jared, the victim was from Flight 828. If that's the reason that she was killed, then I need to know because I could be next, or Ben, or Cal. Now the NSA's taken over the case, I need information. You need to stop. You're gonna get yourself in trouble, Nick. I will, but maybe you could make some calls. I'll see what I can do. Thanks. You're not welcome here. How could you? How could you come in? Get out of this house. Did some digging. What is it? What happened? Nothing. I'm good. What do you, uh, what do you got? All right, I'm not gonna stop asking, so why don't you save us both some time? I went to Evie's house and I saw her parents. Why would you do that to yourself? I don't know, Jerry, because the last time I saw them. Make it wasn't your fault. You were cleared. The department did an investigation and they cleared you. You can't put yourself through that again. Hey, please. Don't waste your miracle on your pain. You deserve better. So, um... So I looked at Kelly Taylor and her husband, Patrick. No criminal records for either. They own some commercial properties. Uh, rental workspace building, downtown mall, a couple gas stations. Kelly owned a mall? Nothing fancy. More like a, a shopping center near a subway. Shoe shine, donuts, hair salon. Thank you. 